Hey, what's up, guys? It's Coco Edits, and um, today I'm doing a tutorial on Sony Vegas, uh, mainly because to thank you guys for 150 subs in uh, in one month. It means a lot to me and all your support. And uh, I just I think I'm gonna do a lot of tutorials because a lot of people are asking me, and um, it's a really great way to uh, get a lot of views, and that's what I want. And you guys, of course, uh, appreciating them. Uh, so today we're doing color flashing. Uh, and kind of like um, syncing to the music. It's um, something not really hard, so I'm just going to show you how it looks. Um, this is a video that I posted on my channel if you haven't seen. It's called Sig OC number three. And this is what uh, color flashing is. Um, as you just seen, it syncs. Uh, with the music and it's pretty cool. Okay, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna import your clip. Um, what you can do, you can right click the clip, go into properties, uncheck maintain, man, maintain aspect ratio, and um, check disable resample. Press OK. Uh, when that's done, uh, you can uh, enter your music. So right click here, insert audio track. And then you want to go here to open, go into your folder, you find your music. I want to take the one that has a good beat, probably the one I use in my OCE number three, Champagne Showers by Ariana's Dubstep Remix. Um, you want to find the beats, so I know it starts here, so uh, let's just listen to it. Okay, so I'm gonna stop it here. So you're gonna press the letter S on your keyboard. Uh, S for Samantha, then it'll split like this. You wanna cut the part that you don't want. You wanna delete it. You wanna find the part that you want to start. So just find it and press the letter S on your keyboard. Then delete this part that you don't want, that you don't need. So once that's done, um, you can zoom in to be more precise. So now you wanna mark the beats. So you want to just go through and listen to it. So here is a really big beat. So you want to press the letter M, M for mommy, on your keyboard. It will create a marker so you know that there's a beat right here. So you want to continue listening. There's another one here. Press the letter M on your keyboard. One here. Here. To be like really precise, you can like really zoom in with your mouse, but I'm I'm just doing it like kind of fast. And M here. Okay. So now uh, you want to right click here and insert video track. Uh, now what you want, what you want to do? You want to go into media generators right here in the tab. If you don't have this, you have to go into view and you want to check media generators once that's done just should appear and you'll have you have to go into s yeah solid colors you can take any color you want I'm going to take orange so what you want to do you want to drag it down to your, new, to your new video track and put it at the start of the first beat and then you can just click that you want it to cut it at the end so press the letter S on the keyboard cut the end so that fills in uh, between both then take uh, any color you want. I'm gonna take a red, uh, split, uh, blue, no, yellow, uh, split, letter S on your keyword. And let's put this color. Okay. And now, if you guys watch it, this will it will look like this. As you can see, you don't see anything. You just see like the full color. So what you want to do, you want to go on top of um, your color. You want to drag the opacity to about, let's say about 36. Yeah, about 36. So you want to do the same thing for all of the other colors. So uh, 36. Okay, so once that's done, 
once you've uh, pulled down the opacity, you want to go on the top right of each color. You'll say fade offset. You want to click and drag to the left. You'll do this. We're going to do the same thing. Drag, drag, and drag. So now if you watch it again, it'll look really, really nice. It looks really, really nice. Uh, well, uh, you can raise the opacity if you want it more. You can go to about 44, about something like that. But I think uh, 36 uh, it was. Yeah, it's about it's good enough. So this was just a really simple tutorial on how to do color flashing. A lot of people asked me about this, so I decided to do tutorials, and I'm going to do uh, tutorials much often, like a lot, because uh, I think it's a great way to entertain you guys and uh, yeah, and to get views for myself. Um, and I enjoy doing them as well. So I want to thank you guys for uh, subbing and liking all my videos. I really appreciate it. And uh, see you guys later. Bye.